playing against the 49ers uh, did not turn out the way he'd hoped. Brady threw two picks and the Buccaneers' only points. Those came in the third quarter, a 35-7 loss. Shannon, what percent of the blame does Brady deserve here? 100. 100? 100 percent of the blame. Play defense. Let me ask you a question. Huh. How much? How much credit did you give anybody else in those Ooh. comebacks? You didn't mention the defense huh. when they held him out of the end zone huh. and they kept holding him to three. They kept holding him to three. They got the ball back for Brady. You didn't huh. give the defense any credit then. Huh. Now you blame. Now you blame the defense. I knew that was going to come, huh. but I was ready for you today. Well, well you knew it was going to come. How, how could it not come? Let me ask you a question. It was twenty-eight to nothing at halftime. Let me ask you a question. Yeah, he did nothing. That's exactly right. I'm glad you said that. Huh. It was 28 to nothing. Huh. It could have either been 28 28. What did Brock Purdy do in the first half? What did Tom Brady do in the first half? Huh? What did Tom Brady do in the first half? You do realize when, Sam, when the 49ers scored, they kicked the ball off. They kicked it to Tom Brady. What did Tom do? Well, he threw a touchdown pass to Mike Evans, but it called back because of hold. Okay, did they got hold? Hmm. Did they got hold? Yes. I'll I'll say yes. Oh, you'll say yes. Okay, and that thirteen point comeback Mm -hmm. with under two four minutes with four minutes left. Mm -hmm. How much credit did you give anybody else? Did you give the defense any credit? Sure, I did. No, you didn't. Well, they're they're playing Andy Dalton. Oh, okay, okay. They're playing. Uh, 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 uh. uh. Don't do that. This is Brock Purdy. Oh, exactly. They're playing Andy Dalton. His first ever NFL start is Mister Irrelevant. Huh. So now I'm gonna have to give him. So video, video. Hey DJ, drop the tracks mm-hmm. right quick. Mm-hmm. So I would tell me who you blaming on this one. Mm-hmm. I didn't know is it Todd Bowles, is it the defense, or the terrible pass? No, 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 no. Terrible pass. What are you calling? Terrible pass. Byron Leftwich. What are you calling? Terrible Todd pass. Todd Bowles. Terrible Why pass. would you throw that? That was a terrible pass. Con Davis. What uh-huh. are you doing? Uh-huh. Oh, none of those guys are on offense. Uh-huh. Oh my goodness. Uh-huh. Oh, his arm. He has lost no arm strength. Mm. All he had, Julio had 10 steps huh. on the guy. And what happened? Mm. L- boom, I thought it was duck season. Huh. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, the Julio pass? Yeah. That's in a driving rain that, when that, the ball slipped. Well, it did. It was pouring rain. So what was The one he missed was the Scotty Miller one. Can I ask the you, early one. You got to fixate on that can one. Ask you that question? was terrible. Can I ask you a question? Mm-hmm. So what was Brock Purdy? Was he have a, did he have an umbrella out there? No, he it didn't <laughs> rain till the second half. Shannon, did you oh, watch whoa, the game? Whoa, 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 whoa. You gotta watch the game. I watched it. Okay, it was twenty eight nothing. Well, how many passes did Brock Purdy throw in the second half? Help me out. Tell me how many throw. Hold on, let me get my three passes. Let me get my stats. Let me get three passes in the second half because he didn't need to throw. Let me get my stats. So okay. You said it was driving. So why in the hell is Tom Brady throwing 55 times in a driving rain? Because mm, they can't run a league. Oh, no, they can't run a league. Dead last. You know, my, dead last. So they're running the ball. Dead why, last in the whole league. Why was Tom Brady mm. still in the game late in the third quarter, down 35? You know why? To get stats. No, not to get stats because he's Thomas Edward Patrick Brady Jr. And trust me, Kyle Shanahan is still sitting over there saying, uh oh, we, we got to drive a nail through them. We, we got to stop this. Skip. He, he's done this. A thousand. He's times. done what? Come back and come back. He what? is the comeback king of all what, time. What have you skipped? The man has gotten more mm-hmm. than twenty-two points mm-hmm. twice this year. Mm-hmm. Come back from what? Mm-hmm. So, here, this is yeah. why. This is why. You see I, him against the Rams. You see him against the. How many points Packers? did the Rams? How many you Rams? See him against the Saints. No, I saw him lose. Against, yeah. I saw him lose against the Packers. Mm-hmm. How many points did the Rams have? How yeah. many points did the Saints have? Yeah. He hadn't got. He got the thirty-one time, or well, maybe twice this year. Yep. Yeah. I got it. Tell me when it's my turn. I'm gonna tell you, DJ. This is why I gave 100 percent of the blame. Can we get the, Can we get this? And I would need you to bear with me at home because I don't really like to do stuff like this. Mm-hmm. But I'm gonna just I'll follow suit on my counterpart. Can we get Can mm-hmm. we get that up on the board? Mm-hmm. Can we get the quote on the board? Mm-hmm. Here it is. The level of responsibility that Brady imposes upon himself has always been massive, and this year he's taxed to the max. Mm-hmm. One example: on night before each game, mm-hmm. Brady runs a separate meeting for. Bu- with the Bucs skill players, mm-hmm. doing which he goes over game plans, makes tweaks to the assignments and formation, and provides a re- revised blueprint. One which first-year head coach Todd Bowles, offensive coordinator Byron Leftwich, and the rest of the staff are left to discover in real time mm. once the game begins. Mm. If I'm not mistaken... Are you sure about this report? Skip, I'm just saying what he was saying. Hold on. Okay. So now, every time somebody... Are you say, sure about this on, report? Skip. Every time. Do you, do you know Mike Silver? I do know Mike okay. Silver. All I know right. Mike Silver very well. Okay. But here's the thing what I find fascinating. Anytime somebody tries to say something that might be detriment to Tom Brady, mm-hmm. you question the veracity of it. Mm-hmm. Anytime somebody heaps praise on Tom Brady, you've never heaped, you've never called into question anytime somebody has said something positive about Tom Brady. Mm-hmm. And I need to know why. Mm-hmm. 
Well, because he's the GOAT. He's the greatest ever. He's See? the greatest clutch player Skip. in any sport Skip. ever. So in other words, he's beyond reproach in your estimation. Mm-hmm. Because I'm not writing them off. You, you can do all you want. Skip. So I need you to, I need a conclusion from you today. Is he washed? See, when Is you, he washed? When you got no retort for what I just said. I, that's, I, I, let me finish. Let me finish. When you got no retort for what I just laid out. Shannon, in front of you, he, he has the greatest football mind anybody's ever seen. You know what? If this report is correct, who cares? He should do that. He should do that. I thought he Wait a second. I need a, an answer from you. Who knows more football, Byron Leftwich or Tom Brady? Help me out. Not who knows more football. Oh, no, well, you answer the question. Answer the question because you, you can't. Do? See what you you can't because it's an obvious so, answer. Okay, he knows so much football. Why is he playing so bad? Okay, because for a thousand reasons. Because they've had no continuity on offense all year long, and for some reason they cannot separate. And their no, offensive line is a shambles. You know it, and I know it. How many times did he get Can sacked you even yesterday? Name the people that. How came? many times did he get sacked? Okay, here's the. The How staff, t- here, here's all you need to know. He got hit a season high eight times. All you wow. need to know that he was under pressure 26.4% of the time, which was by far the highest he's been under pressure all year long. How about those numbers? Can you refute those numbers so, for me? So let me get you. I want to make sure I'm hearing you correct. Mm-hmm. Tom Brady has never been hit more in his career, under pressure more in his career, and won a game. Tom Brady, that's what makes Tom Brady great. Through okay. all the adversity, through all the fire, okay. Tom Brady's who, been over to overcome. Who has the best defense by far in the National Football League right now? Help me out. Hold up. So it's t- not even close. Did you see what they did to Tua last week? Yes. Skip, okay. Skip. Well, Brady had a better game than Tua had. Well, skip, he did. Skip. All I'm, skip, all I'm saying is this. Tom Brady had a problem. You said Tom Brady should have had a problem with Byron at the Tom Brady and Byron Leftwich comes up with a game plan. And here's a guy that was mm-hmm. not in the meeting when they came up with it, come in with his red pen scratching out stuff. Yep. Now Tom Brady is not up because most coaches, and NFL coaches, work between 80 and 100 hours in a five, six-day week. So Tom Brady, the night before, he's making tweets when he didn't stay up those 80 to 100 mm-hmm. hours. So shouldn't they have a problem with that? Who, who do you think watches more tape, Tom Brady or all the coaches? All the coaches. Stop it. All the coaches. Skip, I'm not going to let you do it. No, I'm, I'm not going to let you I'm do it. I'm going to do I it. I don't care. I just I'm did not going to let you be disrespectful to these damn coaches yeah, because I'm, I'm you love Tom okay. Brady. Nobody, Tom Brady does no, not watch more no, no than coaches. No, no, He does not. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a flat no, out that's lie. That's a flat out lie that you're perpetrating. Ain't There's no never way. been anything because you, you can't stand it that Tom Brady at 45 Skip. is still playing this game at a very high level. Yeah. Do you see these numbers? Yeah. These numbers say Tom Brady is not playing okay, at the high I level. need you. No, okay, you're that's in the not Hall what it's of about. Fame because you're scared to death of him because he's haunted you. Time out. Ladies and gentlemen at home, I would like to announce the fact, if you're new to our show, that this man for six straight years on this show that we have been partners at this debate desk has tried to send Tom Brady home, said he's washed up, his arm is in decline, and he should just go on home. It started the first day of this show in September of 20. 2016, and he has been wrong for six straight years, and he's going to be wrong again. I'm standing by what I say. How, how, how convinced are you Tom Brady's going to okay. win the Super Bowl? Okay, I, I picked him to win it. No, I'm no, not no. backing off. Well, put something on it. Well, what do you mean? Put some, I put my pride on it. I put my pride. Yeah, I would do Who that. did you pick? You picked the Rams and I, the Chargers, yeah, okay? And, and the only difference is, the only difference is, no. everybody knows the Rams are bad, uh, but they don't want to say Tom okay. Brady is playing just as I, bad I'm as Matt Stafford. Them off. Skip, they're in the Tampa division. They're in the worst division in football. Good. Are they going to be in the playoffs? So, Help me out. Skip, I need you to That's sit. your argument. Okay, that's I need your you. argument. What do you mean that's my argument? Your argument is that they're going to be in the playoffs. Is Tom Brady playing bad? Okay. Yes or yes. no? Yes, he played poorly yesterday. What but do you it mean was, yesterday? Okay, oh, yeah. But you're giving him 100% I of did, the blame? I did. You had, they well, that, that's question. just, you, you have no objectivity. It's just straight Brady skip, hate. Skip. Wait, wait a minute. This is just straight hate by a guy who's jealous that he is still playing at a high level at 45 when you had to stop at 35. Skip, that's what you that's do. That's the point. That's what you do. Every time somebody, every time I call something into question, I'm jealous. No. Skip, I did well, what I, I did. I never said you were jealous of Baker Mayfield. Skip, I did what I did. You make it seem like I was a bum. I'm in the effing Hall of Fame. Okay, I so got three what? Super Bowls. So what? So what? He's way better than you were. I'm better way than you. Better. Skip, what are they? I got to see what you do. You take personal shots. No, when you, for I, don't, I don't take yeah. personal shots. Time you time started time it. Time out. You would take a personal shot at me. I didn't so, take oh, a personal shot at you. Wait a minute. What are you talking about? You would take a personal shot. Put your glasses back on. 
Can I finish? You're willing to take a personal shot at me to say this man is better than me because I say he's playing bad this year? Well, because you 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 just go ahead. You disrespect him. It, it's just so. It, so it's you, beneath, just, you know what? It's beneath your you dignity. You would disrespect me to no, support him. No, well, I'll, I'll support him over anybody because he's the greatest player who ever have played your it. game, and it's by have far. At it. Have at it. Have okay? it. I'm going to have at it because I'm going to have at you because what happened yesterday? The Bucks' defense was horrendous yesterday. What happened? They win the toss and they defer. Let's give the ball to Brock Purdy so that our defense can go shut him down. And Shannon, what happened on the opening drive? Did you watch? Yeah, I I think you probably watched this because you're on the edge of your seat salivating for Brady to screw it up, right? And what happened? They go 67 yards in five plays and all